You don't know it, but this is my third attempt at getting the alpacas in. First time I called them out in the field and the phone rang halfway through the video. Then I um, tried again and my dog decided to open the door and let himself out. So all the uh, alpacas decided that they would um, not come anywhere near me because the dog was near me. And so now I'm actually in the barn because I've they got as far as the barn. That was Araminta just went past a little bit better today, I hope. And the alpacas are just coming in nice and steadily. It's time for their evening meal. If you try to train alpacas, it's a really good idea to get them used to coming into an enclosed area to get some feed. Most alpacas are quite keen to get feed. And so they'll come when you call them in the hope they're going to get something to eat. The other way to do it is to herd them, in which case you want to be a reasonable distance behind them so they walk away from you, but in walking away from you, walk to where you want them to go. So let's just let the last few alpacas in. There goes Celeste. I put a little bit of food down in the trough just to keep them all busy. Let's just walk out and see if I can catch the last few on this beautiful evening. It's been sunny for the second half of today, which feels like the first time for a very long time we've had sun. Come on, girls. Come on. Come on. Come on. Here's just the tail end ones coming in now. Oops, a little baby just rushing across. That's, oh, I think that's Pearl. Just coming to play catch up. Come on. There's Pia still out in the field. Still looks quite stormy here. So what I'm going to do is close the gate on them. So there's my gate. Come on, Pia. In you come. Pia's the last one. She doesn't have a baby in the group and she's got plenty of uh, um, padding on her. So if she doesn't join us, that's fine because they'll all be coming out in about 10 minutes when they've had a chance to have something to eat. Some of them heading there for the water trough. I don't know why they find one water trough nicer than the other, but they do. That quite often is the way. And there's little Venus and Pearl. And I'm just going to get the last ones now in so that I can feed all the adults. As always, Peaches is a little bit separate from them.